So I've been teaching cybersecurity for 20 years, integrated into our existing courses here in computer science and our operating systems and, and networking courses. And, and over that 20 years, the topic has gone from something that sort of happened in the background that was a subject of movies, something that's now of interest to everyone on a daily basis. Cybersecurity is really important because it we rely on computers more than we even understand. Now we're at a, we're at a point where we realize how important security is, but we have all these applications and software that's running that isn't secure, it wasn't designed to be secure. I mean, think about how much you use a system throughout the day, whether it's your iPhone, which has your banking information on it and a lot of other important information to you. Whether you're an individual worried about your privacy or personal security. Cybersecurity is important to us as an industry, economically, being able to protect the data assets that we have. And, and also as a country, militarily, we need to be able to protect assets. So. Uh, cybersecurity is this need that's really driven by the community. It's important because it's always growing. There's new attacks. You have to realize that everything's changing really fast. And also there's a significant interest by the students. I'm interested in cybersecurity because it's really like a growing field right now. It's a new field. It's really upcoming. A lot of like potential jobs and just the fact that Baylor does have a really strong program, it really interests me in joining. So one of the key pieces in our cybersecurity solution here at Baylor is really our industrial relationships. It's very important that we have these relationships so that we can understand what is going on out in the actual real world so that when our students go out that they are well prepared to engage in that environment. All of the subjects that you learn and everything you learn at Baylor does have applicability to what you see in the real world. It's not an easy program, um, but it's rewarding in the end. My time on the cyber defense team has been challenging. It has challenged me to communicate with a bunch of different communication styles. It has challenged me to work on a team. It has also challenged me and the skills that I've learned as they're not typical of other computer science classes. So the Baylor cyber defense team is really about building a team of students that get together and try to conduct cyber defensive operations. So the scenario is usually a business has gotten a new IT team and the old IT team wasn't really concerned about security. So we walk into the room, we know nothing about the whole infrastructure, we know nothing about the computers, no passwords, anything. And the student's job is, while under attack from actually professional hackers, to be able to build up and defend while adding services, the infrastructure for their company. Where might a hacker get in or where might an attacker get in? And then what can we do to identify when they get in or try to prevent them from getting in in the first place. It's that mix of doing analysis and then taking all of that great programming that you learned in the computer science program and actually applying it to a really important and really hard problem. And so it's important that the students get to see this actually in action. It's very easy to believe that you understand uh, how to do things from a cyber defensive perspective, but there's nothing like as close to a real world example as you can get. I've seen my progress and I've seen how much I've improved and how useful my skills are. The people who are at the competitions aren't recruiters or HR people. They are the hiring managers from companies. And they're coming down, they, they watch you in the room competing and then they're like, here's a job for you. We like you. So the purpose of Cyber Day is really to talk about the intersection of Baylor University and cybersecurity industry. It's to really find out from industry leaders at the top level what is of interest in cybersecurity, both from a research perspective and from an educational perspective. So it's very important to be able to bridge that gap between industry, where the students are gonna go, where they're gonna practice their skills, and what we're teaching them here at the universities.